Hey everybody, welcome to another No Tie Tuesday. Ron Beaker here. I'm going to get right into it and then we'll chat a bit. This is a cover of a, a song by Lucas Nelson and Promise of the Real. I believe that every heart is kind So am I just a little under you Hatred is a symptom of the times Lost in these uneducated blues I just want to love you while I can All these other thoughts have me confused I don't need to try and understand Maybe I'll get up, turn off the news Turn off the news and build a garden Just my neighborhood and me We might feel a bit less hardened we might feel a bit more free Turn off the news and raise your kids Give them something to believe in Teach them how to be good people Give them hope that they can see Hope that they can see Turn off the news and build a garden with me Trust builds trust All that negativity's a bust Trust builds trust Don't you want to be happy? Turn off the news and build a garden Just my neighborhood and me We might feel a bit less hardened We might feel a bit more free Turn off the news and raise the kids Give them something to believe in Teach them how to be good people Give them hope that they can see Hope they can see Turn off the news and build a garden with me Turn off the news and build a garden with me Well, that song came on my Spotify this morning and I immediately thought, I think, that, uh, I think we need to hear that song a little bit more these days. So that's a song by, um, by Lucas Nelson and Promise of the Real. It's called Turn Off the News and Build a Garden. So there you go. Um, so I'm going to say hello to some people who I see in the room. Welcome. Thanks for dropping by today for another No Tie Tuesday. I do these every Tuesday at 1230. Going to hang out with for about a half hour here and uh, play kind of whatever's on my heart and mind and, uh, and whatever you request. So if you have a song you want to hear, make sure you put it in the comments. Uh, and if I see, if you make a comment, I can see you in the room and I can give you a shout out and say hello, which I love doing. So be sure if you're here to say hi. Uh, so Robin is here. Hey, Robin. Good to see you again. I'm not big on gardening, but yes to turning off the news. Yeah, well, you know, I'm getting more into gardening a little bit every year. And it was, my wife was out there doing all the planting this weekend. We went and 
bought some plants on Saturday, which was miserable because it was drizzly and raining and cold. Um, but then Sunday it was beautiful. We got to plant them. So things are looking better out there. And every time I garden, I learn something about life. There's some deep ancient metaphors and wisdom buried in every, everything we plant. So, um, yeah, try it. I don't know. <laughs> we, we killed plants for a very long time, I will say. But we're killing less plants these days, so that's great. So I did pick out some other songs with gardening themes. I hope that's okay, Robin. Uh, Clarissa's here. Nice to see you again, Clarissa. Beautiful song. Yeah, that is, it is a beautiful song. Be sure to look it up on Spotify. Give some love to Lucas Nelson and Promise of the Real. I'm sure they have some other beautiful songs as well. I will warn you, there's an acoustic version and an electric version of that song. And the acoustic version has a great big uh, F-bomb right in the middle, which I think is warranted. But um, just be warned. <laughs> Hey, Fritz. Nice to see you again. Uh, Fritz is one of my, uh, the president of my German fan club, so good to have you back. And uh, awesome. Oh, Clarissa says, Nick was counting down the days and then the hours for this. Oh, that warms my heart. Thanks for sharing that, Clarissa. So, um, yeah, if, if there's anything you guys want to hear, be sure to make a request. Um, the other few things you can do that are super helpful, I just want to mention this once and get it out of the way. Um, you can do, where is it, this side? Uh, boom. Those things, there we go. <laughs> so you can comment, uh, you can share. So if you're watching, you think someone else might, might enjoy this, uh, please invite them, share it with them. Even if you couldn't catch this live and you're watching later, that's super helpful. Always, uh, the numbers always grow after this is live. And the more you share, the more Facebook thinks what we're doing here is uh, something other people might enjoy. So that's super helpful. And if you want to leave a tip, you can always do that down here at uh, vonbeeker.com slash tips. But it is not at all necessary. I am happy to do these songs for you for free. Be here with you every week. It's a highlight of my week as well. Um, I have a show coming up on Thursday that's going to be more long-form show. I'm going to be, it's going to be a different backdrop. I'm going to be wearing a bow tie, but I'm going to talk about that more in a few minutes. Um, let's get back to the music. So my show on Thursday is uh, celebrating the release of a new song for me uh, called Haunted. So I'm going to play that for you now. probably forget every other word A man can only hold so much beauty inside At least that's what I've heard And I don't want to find it out the hard way by myself I just let someone else You left with someone else A moment open closed You vanished like a ghost I'm haunted If I could play the game, I'd probably protect my heart from every wound. I almost caught your name, it was written on your cup, but I was looking up. I don't want to admit it, but I know I stared too long. Your eyes were singing songs, and I tried to sing along, but I forgot the tune. It echoes like a ghost, I'm haunted. Well, I've been coming here for just about a year, 6.30 on the clock 
Watching over your spine Right where your last touch down But you don't come around No, you are not around Anymore And if I knew your name I'd probably forget Every other word So that song is called Haunted uh, And Ellen's in the room Hey Ellen, nice to see you Thanks for being here again Always nice to see you uh, I love seeing familiar faces that are back Back in the room week after week It's such a nice little community we have here uh, over our lunch breaks. So um, Thursday night, I'm doing a Zoom release party. And just really quick, what that is, is it's a show much like this, but we do it in Zoom so that I can, uh, you can not just see and hear me, but I can see and hear you. We can have some back and forth, some conversation, have some fun. And I've done these uh, release parties over this past year to celebrate whenever I put out new music and uh, be able to do that in community. So it's not just me by myself watching something go live on my website and Spotify and whatever. And it's been really beautiful times, really exciting. Um, I still remember it was actually a year ago uh, on May 28th. It will have been a year when I released uh, Little Mercies, which I'm going to play next. And um, wrote that song right around, wrote and recorded that song right around this time of year and then released it at the end of May last year. I can't believe it was a year ago already that I stood here in my basement and popped a shit cork of champagne and spilled champagne all over the rug and hope to do something fun and unexpected like that again. So let's see. Um, so if you want to be there on Thursday, uh, just go to my website, vonbeaker.com, uh, to find tickets uh, or click the bio link in my Instagram. I think I even put a link right in the description of this very video. So if you go up there, you'll see a link at the bottom uh, and you can grab yourself a ticket. And... Um, and see me there. And I, I would love to hang out with you Thursday night. It's going to be a longer show, some more, more covers. Um, we're going to talk also about what ifs and what could have been. So if you have a good what if story, let me know. Uh, something that you came to a fork in the road, you made a decision, it led your life in one way, but what if you had made the other decision? Um, that's kind of what the song Haunted is about. So we're going to talk a lot about that. Um, okay. The Rasmussen's are here. Hey, welcome. <laughs> so Kristen and her kids voted on what tie I should wear on Thursday night for the show. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you the ties, and I'd, I'd love you to join in if you want to make a vote. I put this over on Instagram and Facebook, but... Um, got them? Oh, yeah. <clears throat> so I, I keep buying these ties because Le Chateau is this Canadian retailer, and they're going out of business. And they're one of the few places that sell bow ties all the time. And uh, I can't resist if I'm, God forbid, I'm in the mall. Um, I don't think I'll be going back there for a very long time. But I was there and I, I saw that the prices were even cheaper because they're going out of business. So I had to go in and I came out with five bow ties um, on last week. So <laughs> it's dangerous. But all five, it would cost me $25 and I got the bill and it was like, you saved $183 or some crazy thing. Because some of these are really nice feather bow ties that they were selling for like 45 bucks a piece. And I got them for, I don't know, $5 or something. So crazy deal. So anyways, um, I'm gonna, this is option number one. Okay, so I might need to get out of the way here for it to focus on it. Oh, there we go. Okay, so this is option number one. We'll call this, we'll call this the blue one. Okay. And this is option number two. And we'll call this the... The speckle, okay? Both of them are, you know, pretty high quality bow ties. Both of them are covered in feathers, which is amazing. So I really want to wear one of them during my show on, on Tuesday. So let me know, should I wear the blue one? You just heard the song, so that's kind of the theme of the night on, on Thursday, sorry. So should I wear the blue one or the, the speckle one? You let me know in the comments. Have ourselves a real vote, because the power is yours. Um, Clarissa says, blue. All right. I know Kristen's kids each had their own opinion, and Kristen, I think, was in favor of the blue. I'm feeling like the blue one, I really like the, the black and white one because it's pretty phenomenal, but I'm feeling like the blue one has a lot of, uh, getting a lot of love. It might just feel 
might just feel haunted. I'm also going to be premiering the music video for Haunted during the show on Thursday night. And uh, there's lots of blue tones in that too. So maybe that, maybe that makes sense. Uh, Clarissa says, can you play Angel today? For sure, I will. So I'm going to play uh, Little Mercies and then I'll play Angel. Great. Oh, Robin says speckled. Robin, you got to you got to make it more complicated, right? Man. That's okay. That's okay. We'll wait. We'll wait till the end. We'll let the dust settle. We'll see who wins this fight. I will wear the speckled one sometime soon if not Thursday cuz I really love it. Okay. Little mercies.
right, Little Mercies. Uh, Robin says, such a great song, I need to become a reviewer. Yes, please. Start a really influential blog and um, tell everybody how great Von Beeker's music is. I, she's making a joke there, I believe, in reference to, I, I posted on Facebook this week. I, so the song Haunted that you heard a couple songs ago um, that I'm releasing this week, I put it out, um, put it out uh, this, it's coming out this week, and I put it out to some playlist, um, this website that tries and gets, tries to convince people to write reviews and blogs and playlist and share it on playlists and all kinds of stuff. So basically just hustling to try and get some PR to get um, strangers to listen to and like this new song. Uh, and I do it with most um, songs that I put out. And uh, you upload the song to this site, you, you uh, pay a little bit of money and ask a bunch of people to give it a listen, and then you sit by your inbox and just watch emails come in one after another about why people are not interested. <laughs> and it's, um, it's pretty depressing. So I always joke that it's, um, it's called Submit Hub is the website. I always joke that it's Submit Hub Rejection Day. And Robin was... Um, consoling me that, you know, I wasn't getting the praise that I so deserve, uh, which I agree. But uh, I, did, I did end up getting some, um, some love for this song, so that's great. Uh, and um, some, the stuff, the, the comments that are not love are just make me laugh, so it, they're, they're pretty funny. So for Haunted, um, one person's comment was like, Basically, like, really love the song, great vibe, whatever, but we're not really into sharing songs about ghosts and um, scary things or whatever. And I'm like, yeah, it's called Haunted, but it's not about ghosts in any way, but that's okay. Okay, so I'm going to play you uh, two more songs and then finish up here for today. So I'm going to play a, one more cover that I uh, kind of had on my heart today, and then I'm going to end with Angel uh, for Clarissa and Nick, and um, yeah, thank you guys so much for hanging out. Ellen says that uh, the song Little Mercies reminds her of her dear departed dog. Yeah, there's a, a friend on Facebook that lost a dog last night that looks very much like my dog Carl, um, and I was thinking of, uh, thinking how grateful I am that, that Carl stuck around because we had uh, some close calls with him last summer with some stuff going on with his spine. And, uh, and if you've seen the video for Little Mercies, you'll know why that, that uh, is related, because the video is kind of a celebration of pets and how they've been a real blessing to a lot of us through these times where we're stuck at home over the past year. So this is a song by one of my favorite artists, uh, His Golden Messenger. Uh, strange name, but great music. This is called Heart Like a Levy. I think this is the first song I ever heard uh, came up in my recommendations, and then I just dug deeper and fell in love. So this is Heart, Heart Like a Levy. Fire for 
for you Oh, sing me a song Oh, sing me a song Oh, lay a season and it move like a wheel in the sky Oh, it's yours two roads, honey Tell me which one leads to mine Oh, sing, little sister Be patient with me when I don't have the right Try standing in the way with the sky still changing. What's it gonna take to keep you from taking this so serious? I know the dead they're raging, standing in the way. Carry my piece of the fire Got a heart like a levy Oh, I swing for the mountains in double time Do you hear me running? Did I carry my piece of the fire? So that song is by uh, Hiss, Hiss, like a snake. Hiss, Golden Messenger. It's called Heart Like a Levy. Um, you can just put him on shuffle on Spotify. I could do that all day. with this by request from Clarissa and Nick. This is uh, Angel. You got an angel in you. She's wrapped around your bones. Girl, she's no danger to you. No, she's just trying to find her way back home. She's got a future, I can see it in the shimmer of your eyes Oh holy creature, I'll be keeping watch Waiting for you to come alive Oh, oh, oh Oh, oh, oh Oh, 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 oh. You're disappearing from view One look in the mirror at a time I'm missing hearing from you Even if it's just to pass the time Just so much bigger than the past you left behind Oh holy creature, we're all keeping watch Waiting for you to come alive Whoa, oh, oh, oh. Whoa, oh, oh. Whoa, oh, oh. Oh, oh. 
You've got an angel in you She's wrapped around your bones Girl, she's no danger to you No, she's just trying to find her way back All right, well, that'll do it for today. This is uh, week 10 of No Tie Tuesday, believe it or not. So I've uh, been doing this every Tuesday for 10 weeks. It'll keep on going because this is a highlight in my week. Uh, if nothing else, to make sure I practice for at least a half an hour every week. I do practice for more than that. Most, most weeks. Uh, Chris says, thank you. Yeah, thank you, Clarissa. Thank you for being here. Um, it's, it's much more fun when I'm... Uh, playing for people <laughs> than just by myself in my backyard. Although I'm sure my neighbors are getting free concerts uh, now that it's nicer outside in the backyard. So um, we'll be back here next week. But before that, of course, uh, get your tickets to come join the party on Thursday night. I would love to, to have you there and uh, play some more requests and rock out with you and uh, and if you are coming just make sure you get yourself a glass of something special whatever that is that you most like to drink when you're celebrating something uh, could be a beautiful uh, tea with like flowers in it and all sort you know no matter what no matter how good tea looks or smells I have to say to me I always end up sipping it and being like oh that tastes like tea which, which isn't a bad thing but um, whatever your favorite tea is it could be uh I have some fancy Anejo tequila that we just got at Costco that I broke into last night a little bit, and it was delicious. So that might be what I'm celebrating with. Or I might get myself another bottle of Prosecco, the, the poor man's champagne, just to see if I can do a better job at popping the cork this year than I did last year. Um, yeah, but we'll see you then. Otherwise, uh, we'll catch you here next week on Tuesday. Everybody have a great week. Stay safe. Uh, get your get your vaccination if you haven't done that already. Um, I can get them for my kids now, which I'm really excited about. So things are things are looking up. See you soon, everybody. <laughs>